it seems on a daily basis you're talking to bankers, lawyers, real estate brokers in a variety of different industries. How do you stay up to date on different industries going on? What do you read? Um, great question. I mean, I, I love reading um, books in general, but um, honestly, it's just social media is, is huge. Um, Twitter is great <laughs> if, 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 if you follow the right people. Okay. So um, protect what goes in your two ears. Um, the energy of the people and the environment that you're around is really, really important. So it's like very simple. Like if you want to recreate yourself or get to another level in your business and your life and your future, um, all you got to do, it's actually really, really easy because everyone here is extremely intelligent, talented, likable people. Just change the information that's going between your two ears every day. Like what you see, what you think about. Like if you watch crazy reality TV and hang out with three friends that gossip about their crazy boyfriends and this and that and the other, and that's all you listen to, are you going to think about crazy boyfriends or girlfriends and, and this and that a little bit more? Of course, even if you're the smartest person ever. But if you talk to one person that's doing something really cool, it's probably going to, you're not going to suddenly just become a billionaire, but are you maybe going to think about something different tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Probably, right? So just control what's going in, and that's when ideas and, and conversations start happening. And the best way to do this, guys, is never lead with, with, with selfishness. Mm -hmm. Find a way every person you meet, find out what they do. Let's say you meet someone, and let's say there's a guy, that, there's some smart guy here that's doing a tech startup. Let's just say I'm just going to make up a story, right? And he's a really sharp guy, but he's never ran a company before, and he needs to find a certain type of developer to do it. Don't say, hey, bro, I'll invest, how I'll do this. No, 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 no. Just tell him what you do. It's like, oh, that's interesting. Hey, let's stay in touch. Let's grab coffee. Not to get something. Yeah. Not to get something at all. You don't need anything. Go find, let's say find you, you're like, I know one person that's a developer. Say, hey, John, do you know someone that does this? I don't, but this, my friend, this guy knows someone here. Talk to this guy to this guy. Say, hey, can you do it? Hey, I have a friend that has a tech startup. I'd love for you to meet him. Call the guy and said, hey, I know you said you were looking for this. I found a guy that might be interested. Do you want to all have coffee? Bring him and help him. And let's say that works out. Do you think that guy is going to be willing to help you out down the road? Even if he doesn't, do you think that he's going to tell someone, oh, my friend this, hooked me up with this person, this person. You think that makes you look good? Sure. Do you think if you end up starting something down the line and you have that connection, that's going to pay off? Absolutely. And so find a way to do that to everyone. Look, I don't have to guess or worry about if someone likes me if I make them money. They will always like me if I make hey, If they hate me and I make them money and I do, do good business, they will do business with me. Now, I would say that I, I think I'm likable, but I'm not trying to bet the, bet the house on my likability. I, I want to bet the house on how we do business as a company, how my people are, and the impact that we're making in their lives. Because I promise you, when you make people's lives better, their kids better, everything better, things are, it's, it's weird. Like, it gets easy. Because everyone wants to help you. Everyone wants to do business with you because every person you do business with, you make them money. So why would you, like, why would they never, like, you know what I mean? There's always going to be an opportunity or a deal for you. So that's the best way I can I could describe that. No, for sure. And while we're on the topic of reading and staying updated, 